quest update. I need a health. I need a health potion. Ooh, Seven Eleven. Okay, I'm excited, dude. Seven Elevens. I've not been to a Seven Eleven yet. I've, I've been to a Family Mart. It was fucking fire. Yeah, health potion, as in coffee and a painkiller, like a fucking Max Payne. Okay, you pull it for a second while I use Google Translate. What the? F Why doesn't it say it in, so I can read it? In like Romanized? Oh. Yeah. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm trying to understand what he's saying. Sumimasen, Ichiban. What the f? Ichiban nakana doku desu ka? Doku desu ka means like where is. Doku desu ka. But you want to say it yes, you say like 7 Eleven doku desu ka. Okay, Sumimasen, 7 Eleven doku desu ka? Okay. Yeah, dude. Dude, I'm so... <laughs> I'm learning, dude. It's fucking Duolingo time, baby. Let's go. <laughs> oh, look at the fish. 7-Eleven, doku desu ka? Sumimasen. 7-Eleven, doku desu ka? <laughs> oh, so sick. I'm basically Japanese now. It's not even a big deal. <laughs> In Japan, it's not cars that you gotta worry about. It's fucking bikers, dude. <laughs> bikers fucking go crazy out here. Holy sh! Okay, are you guys ready for this? Unless you've experienced the beauties of Wawa personally, you probably are thinking, Hassan, why the f are you going to a convenience store? Well, the reason why I'm going to a convenience store in Japan is because they are very famous. The convenience stores here actually serve incredible cuts of meat in comparison to meat quality in the United States. And for that reason, people, a lot of people, come into uh, convenience stores like 7-Eleven, Family Mart, Lawson. Anyway, let me show you some of the craziness out here, okay? First of all, blammo. Holy sh**. Everything is crazy. Like, I guess probably because like, it's in, also in Japanese, so that kind of changes the and it makes it more different than what you would have in a normal convenience store. Oh yeah, that's another thing. You can always get drunk in public. That's allowed. Encouraged even. Encouraged. We're not gonna do that, of course. Basically, anything you get here is it's gonna be fire. It is fire. I've already had some of this shit. I wanna try the strawberry whipped cream and custard. What the fuck? I had the egg salad. That shit was incredible. I had, there's a shrimp cutlet with sauce. I'm not gonna touch that, obviously, but like, all of this is safe and also delicious, which is wild to think about when you think about gas station food. Now, of course, I am a psycho and I love gas station food. I have it in America. <sighs> I usually go to the 7-Eleven and sometimes will treat myself to a chicken salad sandwich from 7-Eleven, which is kind of embarrassing to admit, but it is the truth. We just Googled it and we found out that there's no medicine at convenience stores, which is a big L. Okay, one L for Japan, one L so far, only one L. Probably a good reason for it. Look at the fucking variety of shit you can buy here. Like, I don't even know what the fuck this is. Like, it's like rice bowl, pork, and soy sauce. All right, I'm gonna get one egg salad, which I had earlier today, and it was fire. Look at this pork sausage, chili, meat filling. I saw some fucking freak of nature shit out here too. Pork ham boiled egg and mayonnaise. Fried chicken, Two. Japanese style, soy sauce flavor, and uh, spicy. Uh, no, no, no. This, this, and then this. Here, bro. How do you go? Uh, yes. Hi. Dude, I'm, so, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. It's just rolling off the tongue, you know what I mean? <laughs> you can't see them. Soy is so hot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel so like I feel so ooh right now. <laughs> I'll be out front. She basically was saying like, "Wow, you're just Japanese." I think she probably thought I was Japanese. It happens a lot to me. It never happens. I had a Japanese soy chicken. Oh my god! But well, how did they make it like this? It's juicy as. F this one I think is the. Oh, bro. This is fried chicken that we just got at a fucking 7-Eleven, dude. It's juicy. It has the fat. And then this is the spicy one. It's not very spicy. At the Family Mart, 
I had a spicy one and a regular one. I tried both and I preferred the spicy one. Here, spicy one I still prefer, but god damn, this shit is goaded. You will never be Japanese. You will never find the love of your life in Japan who looks like this and is a cutie pie Japanese girl. You will never be a protagonist in an anime. You will never have superpowers that allow you to overcome your most greatest tribulations. You'll always be a loser. Moon Moon, I challenge you, sir. I'm quite literally in Japan right now. And I'm pretty sure that's basically halfway to being Japanese. How the f do we dispose of the trash, though? Yeah. <laughs> you claim I'll never be Japanese, yet I'm currently in Japan. Interesting. <laughs> I keep saying sumimasen to random strangers that look at me weirdly, but <laughs> they're looking at me weirdly because they're like, how is he so fluent in, in Japanese? The 7-Eleven experience, a decadent journey. I give it an 8 out of 10. The cafe latte is incredible. It's not super sweet, but it's not tasteless. The fried chicken was incredible. My Watch out. Oh my god. I was the not even move. You were almost dead regardless. Yeah, Japanese bikers wait for no man, honestly. Okay. okay, we're gonna try the egg salad now. The 7-Eleven egg salad. You walking and eating though? Hmm? Walking and eating though? Not the meta? To my understanding, big no no. Wait, really? Yeah. Wait, did we sit right here? Yeah. Why? I don't know. Did you just make that up? No. Chat, back me up here. My understanding if it's like a small little snack or something, then it's chill. But if you're eating like an entire sandwich and have like a coffee in your hand and you're just like walking around eating, I'm pretty sure it's like, that's too much. Why? Who gets to decide? <laughs> Says who? Who makes these decisions? I the fucking shogunate? Yeah. <laughs> I'm leaving no crumbs though. Like Japanese people probably look at my skill. That egg salad sandwich that I just fucking inhaled is probably one of the greatest egg salad sandwiches I've ever had in my entire life. The only egg salad sandwich that was better than the one that I just inhaled it was the Lawson, or no, the Family Mart one that I had <laughs> the other one you had earlier one. today. My second egg salad of the day, so far, everything has been incredible. Every frame is like a painting in this fucking city. Sorry, I don't know, I don't care if you're fucking gonna say like orientalizing or whatever. The public transit is out of control. It's so clean, it's so swift. Trains literally come immediately back to back to back to back. You don't wait for anything. They're a little slammed, but not like insane. Even when they're super packed, um, there's a lot of like courtesy, common courtesy that people follow, which make it so much better. Like it makes it a pleasant and pleasurable experience. You know, we're doing the day in the life of a true Brexit Giza, Japan edition right now. And so far it's fucking awesome. I've, I've gone to two convenience stores. We got a bunch of sh not like New York. No, it is like insanely clean. America doesn't even have subway stations, but when they do have subway stations, it's still like dog. You know what I mean? It feels a lot quieter too in a nice way, yes. Everywhere that we've been so far, there have been hundreds of people around us. But you don't even hear a f***ing peep. No one is talking, no one's on their phone. We are probably the loudest, and I'm trying to be as like quiet as possible too. <laughs> yeah. What? What are you laughing at? <laughs> You're like, I'm trying to be as quiet as possible. 